Okay, so the Fly Lady step for today, our new routine habit for the day is dress to shoes. And Fly Lady always says dress to your lace-up shoes. Now I'm going to be completely honest with you. In full disclosure and completely transparent, I struggle with this one the most. Out of all the Fly Lady routines, and habits. This one is the one that really challenges me. I mean, I work from home, so I seldom ever even go out of my apartment. And I live in South Florida, where it's like basically 100 degrees year round. We don't have winter here, and we don't have fall here. We, the closest thing we have to seasons is we get about a two-week window where we have like spring-like temperatures during when the rest of the world is having their winter. So pretty much nobody wears shoes in South Florida. Anyway, that's the one that challenges me the most. But I get where the fly lady is coming from this because she feels like if you've, you've got your shoes on and you're all laced up, you know, you feel ready to go. You're ready to tackle the day, tackle the world, tackle your to-dos, your challenges. I get that. It's like a mental thing. And it makes sense. I mean, obviously when you're slouching around the house all day not wearing shoes, you're more, you know, you're kind of like laid back, more passe. You know, it's for me, I call it living on island time. I don't live on an island, but I'm close to one. I'm close to a lot of them in Southwest Florida. So I say I live on island time. And yes, there is a difference when I have shoes on versus when I don't. But to be honest, I just don't want to wear shoes all the time. And aside from that, have you ever visited Florida? There's sand everywhere. Seriously, there is sand everywhere. Um, I come from North Georgia and everything is gravel. We have gravel driveways, gravel walkways, gravel roads. Down here in South Georgia, South Georgia, South Florida, Everything is made with shells, seashells, everywhere crushed shells. Well, shells usually come from the beach, and the beach has sand. I could literally put my shoes on in the apartment, walk out my breezeway to the sidewalk, out to the parking lot, get in my car, drive across the street to Target, in their parking lot, walk in park. Target, come back, staying in the sidewalk, parking lot, breezeway, back in my apartment, and I could literally shake sand off my shoes. Sand is everywhere here. When my mom comes down to visit me, she usually comes, she doesn't drive, so she usually comes down with my daughter and sometimes my daughter's boyfriend, but usually there's a few of us here, you know, it's like a little family visit going in and out. My sweet little mama will sweep, sweep my apartment 10 times a day. And I'm like, mama, 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 you're never going to get rid of that sand. So I just choose not to wear shoes in the apartment all the time. But that is the habit for the day is to get dressed in your shoes. So In honor of this video, I have shoes on today. But I do have to say that I have been kind of wearing my shoes a little bit more during the day. I've been working really hard on working toward my fitness goals. So I've been getting up and working out in the morning, going for a walk around the pond. And so when I keep my shoes on, you know, I kind of get that fitness vibe going so I feel all athletic and you know fit and healthy when I wear my tennis shoes in the house okay
I can say that. I can say that I feel fit and healthy. But I do wear them sometimes, but not always. Plus, again, going back to, I work at home, so I'm in my apartment all day long. But at our apartment complex, we have a pool, a really nice pool with a nice little courtyard and a little gazebo area and just lots of little seating area out in the sun and the shade by the pool just whatever plus we have like this little pond that it's like a little fishing pond and they have a little beach area with like some sand and some little adirondack chairs and so sometimes on my break i like to go out and sit either by the pool or sit in the little sandy area by the pond so who wants to wear shoes when you go out and sit by the pool or, you know, you're hanging out in the sand by the water? So, you know, I think this one is really, really, I get, I get the science behind it. I get the whole, like, mental, like, I'm dressed, I'm ready for the day. But this one's really a kind of a personal thing and personally... I struggle to put on shoes every day. I don't really see a reason for myself to have shoes on every day. So I choose not to. But that doesn't mean that you shouldn't. So take it for what it's worth. Be sure to check out Fly Lady's website. And I'll see you tomorrow with the next Fly Baby lesson. Bye.